Welcome back. In an earlier tutorial we created a base project and in this short video tutorial we will create a communication driver, create a station or PLC associated to that communication driver, and import our tag variables directly from a PLC program file. If we right click on COM drivers we can see that we can add a new COM driver configuration window will appear that allows you to see all the native drivers that are uh, included in MoveCon 11.3. We've uh, created a driver based on Allen Bradley Ethernet IP and now we will configure a station. You can see there's several selections. We're going to select Control Logics, Compact Logics, give it its uh, own unique name and configure a generic IP address. Once you've created a station you can uh, create additional stations uh, per your application. Now that a station has been created I can import variables from a PLC file. In this case, it, uh, Movicon looks to utilize the uh, RSLogix 5000 import export file, which is an L5K file. When I select that file, you can see that uh, Movicon was able to successfully read it, including our user defined with multiple variables. We've created two, one called a valve and also one called a motor each with several members based on floating points and some booleans. I'm going to select all variables associate it to the station I created and import. If you look in the real-time database under variables now you can see that uh, I was able to successfully import my variables if we look at a structure, we can see that the uh, members are available. And the actual connection to the PLC is at the top level here. So you configure the connection at your structure. So valve 1 is uh, connected to the PLC valve 1 user defined. And all the members are automatically configured. 